Star Wars is no stranger to shifting plans, but George Lucas had up to 12 movies planned at one point, split into three trilogies and three other more standalone films. This original setup looks way different than what we ended up with, and we've even seen some of George's original notes for the layout. A New Hope in this version was actually Episode 6, making up the original trilogy with Episodes 7 and 8. The prequels, rather than being what we know now, would have been one standalone prologue for Episode 1, then Episodes 2, 3, and 4 as a Clone Wars trilogy, and 5 as an intermediate movie between the Clone Wars and A New Hope. Early in the production of A New Hope, Lucas even spoke to some of the cast like Mark Hamill about appearing in possible future installments, asking him if he'd like to appear in 9 in around 2011 to take a similar role to Ben Kenobi, handing off the lightsaber to the next generation for the sequel trilogy. 10 and 11 would have completed the sequel trilogy, and then we'd have episode 12 as the big finale. 